Welcome to our lab exercise week 7. This week, we are going to focus on how to create a data set to, to create a scatter plot and to calculate a correlation coefficient. In the first part, I'm going to show you how to create a scatter plot. In order to do that, click graph and then chart builder. Under the gallery, okay, so find scatter dot. Choose simple scatter and then drag over into the preview area. Alright, so now you have to identify what goes in uh, X axis and Y axis. Remember, the x axis is your independent variable and the y axis is your dependent variable. In this case, I'm going to uh, identify the relationship between uh, tempo berkhidmat and markah penilaian. Okay, so I think that uh, someone with higher value of tempo, uh, tempo berkhidmat uh, will probably have a higher uh, chances to get a higher markah penilaian. Okay, so this means that uh, the markah penilaian uh, depend on the tempo berkhidmat. So tempo berkhidmat uh, will be in the x axis and markah penilaian will be in the y axis okay so you can change the axis label and uh, the title in the element uh, properties dialog box here okay so let's see I, I want to add the unit and I want to change the title to correlation between tempo berkhidmat and markah penilaian okay so once done click on ok okay and you can see the scatter plot in the output Okay, so this is our scatter plot. Okay, so from the diagram, okay, we can kind of see that uh, there is a correlation between the two variables here. Okay, um, we can see that uh, it, it is not in a perfect straight line, but uh, we can, we do see that there is some relationship. Okay, so those points are kind of going upward as the tempo berkhidmatan uh, increases and maka penilaian is getting better. Okay, so we can say that uh, there is a positive correlation between the tempo berkhidmat and also uh, maka penilaian. Okay, so this is our scatter plot. Okay, so from the diagram, okay, we can kind of see that uh, there is a correlation between the two variables here. Okay, um, we can see that uh, it, it is not in a perfect straight line, but uh, we can, we do see that there is some relationship. Okay, so those points are kind of going upward as the tempo berkhidmatan uh, increases and maka penilaian is getting better. Okay, so we can say that uh, there is a positive correlation between the tempo berkhidmat and also uh, maka penilaian.